Thomas, welcome back to Competitive Action. I think it's been three months since we last saw you with the, the birth of your child. Congratulations with that. How excited are you to, to get back out there and tee it up this week? Very. Um, I missed uh, competitive golf, really. Um, I mean, I practiced a bit at home, but um, I was being a dad. And um, yeah, it's the competition that I missed the most, for sure. But um, I'm really looking forward to get going this week. Obviously, it's a completely different dynamic this week with team golf to start off the calendar year. A lot more of a relaxed way to start the year, I would say, as well. Are you feeling relaxed about it all? Yeah, very. It's it's lovely to have a team room. Um, it uh, reminds me of, of the Ryder Cup I played, and obviously it's not, not the same magnitude, but um, it's nice getting to know some of the guys a bit better, some of the caddies. Um, it's a good atmosphere. How's the dynamic between you all? You've had a practice session out there today. Um, yeah, I played with uh, Noren and Dietri, and they're, they're good friends of mine, so uh, it, uh, it, it felt very, uh, very comfortable. Talking of friends, some friends on the opposite team as well, I imagine, but they'll turn into to rivals for this week. You started the banter early, I saw, on social media. How do you think that dynamic might change during this week? Um, I don't know. Um, you still want to beat the guys. It um, doesn't matter who's on the team. You, you still want to win. I think all of us are... are our competitors and um, there's only one thing we want and obviously this week is a great chance to, to showcase your your match play skills obviously you have showed that in the past but it's a way to put yourself back in that shot window ahead of the Ryder Cup at the end of the end of the year yeah you want to obviously get the, the rust off your game and, and hopefully get some points um, and show that you're um, you came to play and hopefully have a, have a good season after that and just finally your captain Francesco Molinari this week he's going to be key in success of your team. What's he said to you so far? Has he given you a specific role? No, not really. Francesco's pretty quiet. I mean, he's, uh, but whenever he says something, it's spot on. So um, hopefully we, we get a couple of motivational speeches out of him. We'll, we'll see. Best of luck for the week. Thanks for your time.